Hey guys, so uh, I have been out and about with the Sony Xperia Z5 and I uh, wanted to do a quick little video here checking out what the device uh, can do when it comes to the photography. Uh, it does score quite high according to the XO mark, so I was quite keen to check it out. Uh, you can see uh, we do have a very fully featured camera app here, uh, which gives you a lot of control over different things. You can see we do have uh, different uh, kind of scenes you can put on. I did try to use a few of them uh, to test, uh, particularly like the gourmet uh, scene, very relevant for me because I do like food. Uh, you can also obviously use the superior auto mode which uh, will do things for you and you don't really have to do much. Uh, I was quite also impressed that the ca camera is capable of shooting uh, very high resolution at uh, 16 by 9 as you can see and uh, that is pretty cool and I also wanted to see if the camera heated up at all using the device like with the 4K uh, so uh, as I said I have been out and about uh, with the uh, the uh, device and uh, you can see uh, we have been taking some pictures here uh, I will obviously uh, blow them up on your screen so that you can basically see uh, what I've been taking here, but overall I'm very impressed uh, with uh, the performance here of the uh, camera, you know, I think uh, it's uh, definitely uh, in the top flight of uh, Android phones here when it comes to the uh, detail as well as the colours. Uh, is it uh, remarkably better than what's on the competition? Probably not really, I think uh, as I said uh, I was uh, thinking that uh, we have reached kind of like a peak here uh, but in, for the people who care uh, the uh, DxO mark uh, who are more kind of better at uh, assessing the quality of the images do uh, say that this is the best in terms of the overall experience like the stabilization uh, contrast and all that and uh, they are quite uh, well respected uh, in the field so uh, we did uh, do quite a lot of uh, different shots here as you can see, a few macro, a few HDRs and uh, we also did some nighttime shooting to check out the low light performance as well uh, and uh, I'm very impressed here with the uh, shots from the latest uh, Sony handset. Uh, also did do a video recording test here so uh, you can see uh, basically how the 4K is handled. Hey guys, so uh, this is a test of the Sony Xperia Z5, uh, the 4K video recording. So, uh, quite interested to see how it handles this and uh, if the device heats up at all. So, gonna do it for a little bit longer than I would usually do it for while we test like the stability and things like that. So you can see I am walking here uh, and seems to be quite stable. I have turned the steady shot feature off for the time being. I might put that on though in a moment. Let's just check out the zooming. So you can see what the zoom is like. I think it's got a lossless zoom here. That's what Sony says. And it seems to be quite good. You can see quite far away here. Let's zoom back in again. I think the controls could be a little bit better for the zooming, it's a bit weird. Uh, but it seems quite nice here. Uh, let's just try the focusing in on something. So what about this nice bench here? So you can see very nice and fast to focus there. Wow, look at that. That is fast. So you can see nice and close here, detail. So it seems the focusing is quite nice and fast here. Uh, let me just put the steady shot feature on. 
So this is the steady shot feature for the Sony Xperia Z5. Uh, so we can see if it looks any more steady. Just gonna have a walk. And it certainly looks very nice and steady here as I'm really kind of walking. Look at that, wow. That is fantastic stabilization. Can't even see it moving at all. I could probably run and it would stay very kind of stable. Look at that. That's fantastic. So probably gonna use this feature on the device when taking video. So obviously what we have to also consider is that this is a very new device and there will be software updates going forward to improve as well the uh, kind of performance that uh, many devices do go through and uh, you know so far though on this early software very impressive stuff here I'm glad that Sony did like drop the old sensor and actually do uh, bring like a new one here so yeah, uh, I think I might also test out the front facing cameras if anyone's interested in that uh, to see the selfie kind of a comparison. Uh, so also I will be doing some comparisons of the device with some other handsets obviously. But uh, yeah, just a quick little video here checking out the camera performance on the Z5. Hope you did enjoy and I will see you in the next one. Cheers.